This is a short video to show you the speed at which a nonconformance can be quickly entered into the windchill system. First thing that I'm going to do is type a name. I'll put in who uh, the originating person or user is within the system, what type of standard operating procedure might be affected. Under the affected objects, I can quickly do a wildcard search for any of the SOPs, grab that standard operating procedure, and that's it. I'm done. You'll notice that nonconformance was placed in the system. I can easily come back to my browser here and just hit an F5 to refresh my system. And then under my home page, you can quickly see there's that new task. The next person in line who might be a manager or supervisor of that particular uh, uh, document or part can come in, enter review the details of that. Um, they can choose to see the prior step that was completed on intake, choose to uh, maybe not ship the product or if it's a productivity only related issue, if we need a further investigation or not, any types of dates, and then uh, if they're going to cancel or continue the nonconformance, and we can also push it back to the prior step to get more detailed information. Very quickly to come in and complete this step as well. All of these were purposely built to enter each of these steps in 15 seconds or less. So you'll notice now I've gone in on this document nonconformance. I've entered it into the system and I'll hit an F5 again to show how a supervisor or manager has come uh, into the system, reviewed that nonconformance and now it's on the disposition step. That completes the movie. Thank you.